Hey there internets, I'm Michael and this is To Can Play That Game with an unboxing of Adrenaline from Czech Games Editions. So let's get the plastic off here and you can see we've got two copies here and that is because we are giving them away in our To Can Win That Game in December. So that's running from the 1st of September till the 21st. So do be sure to click the link in the description to enter the giveaway for a chance to win a copy of Adrenaline. Okay, so let's take a closer look inside the box. And off comes the lid, or oh, nice little thump there. Okay, what we got? All oh, bags. I love having bags in games. Not many though. Hmm, six bags. That should be enough, hopefully. And we've got some promotional leaflets, not too bothered by those, those can disappear away somewhere. This looks to be the most interesting part, we've got plastic seal, oh this is very tight. So this has these lovely minis in here, so let's have a closer look. So, not sure how well that's coming up with the lighting there. But yeah, really nice, really different, um, this different kind of base, the plastic moulding here has done a really good job, these are really high quality, um, they're super thick, super detailed, these are some of the best miniatures I've seen in games, um, th these are giving cool mini or not a run for their money, they really are, then we've got some lovely little see-through stuff here, so check games are great for their skulls. You can see here we have these red skulls that are absolutely fantastic and a lovely component. These are the same mould I believe as they used in Tolkien, the um, Mayan calendar one. And then we've got some lovely little cubes for the ammo. There's a little bit of uh, bobbling there but nothing too severe, quite good reasonable quality. So let's get those back in the bag before I lose them. And what else we got? What else we got? Oh, so excited. Uh, so we got, oh, these are the health damage tokens, which are meant to be like blood drop shaped. Um, yeah, um, they're, they're nice quality. I'm not sure about the feel of them. I preferred, they used to have, when I played at the UK Games Expo, just some like glass tokens. Those were nicer, but these are probably more affordable. So that's those. Uh, what else we've got in here? We have cards. So let's have a look at these cards. So here we have the uh, upgrades. These are like the special powers that you can get from crates. And uh, yeah, they're lots of different ones. Colour coded, I think, to which area you get them from, maybe, or ammo that you use them for. I think they might be like randomising uh, spawn points you use these. So that would tell you the spawn point to come out at. If I'm remembering correctly, it's been a long time since I played this. Uh, what was it six months since the UK Games Expo? And then here we have our weapon cards. So a good selection here for different things. Really nice clear graphics, some cool first person shooter style artwork there. Really nice, so well done. Oh, these... oh look at this flamethrower, you actually got the fire effect on there. Ah, oh, superb. Superb. I love it. I absolutely love it. Okay, what else we got? What else we got? Let's let's get this plastic tray out of the way. We have the weapons manual. So I'm guessing this just tells you, yep, yeah, all about all the different weapons. So that's really good. So I'll have clarification on the weapons, how they work, in case you're not sure on the images. Though the images look like they're pretty good for telling you what they do. This will just clear up any doubts you might have. And then the rule book. So obviously I will be doing a how to play video, but I do feel it's required to point out the rule book does have a QR code. This will take you to the official rules by uh, Gaming Rules, which is Paul Grogan's channel. He does a fantastic job, lots of CGI, special effects. And yeah, I've, I've watched the video myself. It's really good. He's done a great job on it, he always does, he puts lots of effort into it. So, yeah, if you're not interested in using this really clear, well laid out rule book, which I'm guessing Paul worked on, if we can... I 
don't know if it'll say somewhere if they've got like no i can't see anywhere where they've got like credits who worked on it but given how good it is i wouldn't be surprised if paul worked on that as well and then we've got loads of punch boards here so these are victory points here i think so we've got four point ones really nice interesting to oh Okay, these are coming out really nice and well and quickly, so no risk of tearing. I like that. That's good. <laughs> they are properly just falling out here, which is good. It's good, but it is kind of... Oh, I'm losing bits. Um, so, yeah, uh, really nice clear artwork. This is uh, one of the player boards. These are double-sided, I believe, for two different modes of play. Yep, yeah, there we go. One side and other side. And then we got... Oh, well, these are the ammo tokens, so when you're picking up ammo, this will tell you what you get. So, a card, a yellow cube, and a red cube. So, yep, yeah, that's those, really good. I'm not sure what this little thing here is. Uh, we shall find out. Then, what else do we have here? We have a score track. Oh, and some smaller victory points. So, this score track is for one of the play modes, I'm not sure which, and another one for a different one of the play modes. There are quite a few play modes. I only played one at the Games Expo, so I don't know much about the others. Uh, what we got? More player boards. <laughs> See, everything's just falling out. More victory points. <laughs> I like that it's falling out. I really do. It, me it means that the pushing out isn't going to be difficult, so that's great. And then we've got some more ammo crates, victory points, player boards. Really nice, vivid, bright colours. Love that. What else do we have in here? Oh, it's quite a bit in here. So we've got a board. And uh, if I can fold this, there we go. So this is half a board. And I believe it's, yep, yeah, it's double sided. So the reason for this is depending on the number of players, you'll flip the board. So I think that's probably for fewer players, that's for more players. And then you do the same with the other thing, so, uh, with the other one. So it's three to five players this game. And I am going to work on a two-player variant. And I think you use a different combination of these sides of boards for the different number of players. So that's everything from the box. And yeah, I'll get it all packed up and back in. But I hope you've enjoyed seeing it. And that's what's inside Adrenaline from Check Games Editions. Do be sure to check out the link in the description in order to enter the giveaway for your chance to win this game. And I do hope that you've enjoyed this video and found it interesting. Of course, if you have, please do check out the rest of the videos on the channel as well as subscribing to the channel and sharing it with your friends and family. And do also take a look at us on social media. You can find us on Facebook or on Twitter. And as always, thanks for watching and bye for now.